Hello and welcome to this week's video. It is about vitamin C, not the kind that you ingest, but the type that you put on your skin. Why vitamin C? Because it has so many incredible anti-aging properties. It is key to maintaining a smooth, even, and glowing protection. First of all, it's great for practically every skin type. It's hydrating, it's brightening, so it helps to reduce hyperpigmentation. It also helps to reduce redness and even out skin tone. Reduces the appearance of under eye circles, even just taken and used slightly above. It boosts collagen production, it helps with firmness, and it helps to protect against sun damage. So winner, winner, chicken dinner when it comes to vitamin C. And now that we're in the fall months, we're really assessing our skin post-summer. Like me, I've noticed a few extra spots have shown up on my face, maybe not so diligent with the hat throughout the summer or wanting to get a little bit of color. And it's time to remedy the problem as we get into the fall months where you can really boost your vitamin C, your retinoid, your retinol, and ultra hydrate your skin at the same time. So as I do a targeted video on vitamin C, I wanted to feature an array of products, also an array of price points. First one is by a company called Good Molecules. It's their niacinamide brightening toner, formulated with niacinamide, vitamin C, arbutin, and licorice root to brighten and improve the appearance of enlarged pores. And what's cool is that all the ingredients are listed in percentage form on the side of the packaging. If you like to start with a toner, and I do, you know, a lot of you complain about uneven pores and enlarged pores. What's so nice about a product that has niacinamide and vitamin C in it is it really helps with the reduction of pore size. But because of those two ingredients, it helps to brighten the skin and work on the uneven skin tone. So I like to use this as my starter um, after I cleanse my skin. And this way I'm getting a little bit of niacinamide in the mix. It is the only product that has it in it. And then I can continue on with the serums that I'm about ready to show you. So this was the lowest in price point and we're going up from there. Next up is a product that I love from a company that I love called Womanist. I featured them before. It's made for women by women. They feature a lot of products for women going through menopause, what's happening internally as well as externally. And they've got a vitamin C product that I'd like to share with you. It's called Fountain of Glow Vitamin C Facial Serum. It has 8% vitamin C and plant-derived squalane, which is an emollient to help moisturize. This has a little dropper and you take a few drops into the palm of your hand, rub together, and apply to your face. You can obviously go down to the neck area, but it's a very lightweight vitamin C facial serum. Again, is going to help lighten and brighten. At 8%, it's on the lower side than some of the other products that I'm going to feature for you. And don't forget that vitamin C serums can be applied anywhere you have discoloration, the tops of your hands, your neck, your chest, and it's free from parabens, phthalates, sulfates, artificial colors, uh, formaldehyde, mineral oils. Price point wise, on the lower side, this is $21.99. Like I said, we're going up, 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 but so is the percentage of vitamin C. Next up, a product that I love by a company that I love, Drunk Elephant, founded by Houstonian Tiffany Masterson. This is C Firma Fresh Day Serum. It's got 15% L-ascorbic acid, but it also has 0.5% of ferulic acid and 1% vitamin E for brighter, firmer, and more even looking complexion. So you remove the product from the packaging and it's a powder and you unscrew the cap. Here's the liquid to mix, pour it in carefully. It's going to bubble a little bit. Put the cap back on, shake, 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 shake your C serum, shake your C serum, oh, shake, shake, shake. All right. Anyway, you want to get all the powder to dissolve which is what's happening. Okay, pop it back into the container. Twist and dispense. It dissolves the dead surface skin cells, it hydrates and it smooths. And I can definitely feel 
the hydration going on with this product as well. It really targets uh, photo damage from the sun and it leaves a lot of shine and luminosity. Might be a little bit tricky before makeup in the morning. Maybe this is your nighttime serum because it doesn't dissolve in uh, as easily as the other ones do. But I think at 15%, this is a really good product to have underneath your retinol or retinoid at night. Uh, the C Firma comes in at $78. Time for a little wipage. <laughs> I'm oiled. Next up is one by Ultraceuticals. This is the Ultra C Firming Serum. This one combines pure vitamin C, L-ascorbic acid, but it's got two powerful peptides, microelastin and microcollagen, which helps to smooth wrinkles and make skin look firmer. You pump a few drops onto the hand, rub it into the skin. It says to apply in the morning and if needed to use on alternate days. It is a 10% L-ascorbic acid. This one doesn't feel as oily as the others, which is why it's better suited for the morning. And I, I can feel it drying as I'm talking to you. Uh, but again, if your skin is sensitive to vitamin C, which it might be in the beginning, it's always best to start with lower percentages and work your way up. But a 10% is still considered up there. It's an anti-aging product, but really helps to deal with the loss of firmness as well and wrinkles. So I feel like you get a lot of bang for your buck in this product because it is tackling so much at the same time. So that's something to consider. This Ultraceutical C Firming Serum comes in at $95. Last but most certainly not least is one of my favorites. This is by Sunday Riley, also from Houston. This is her CEO Brightening Serum and the a percentage of vitamin C in this one is at 15%. It's targeted to fight the look of dullness, dark spots, and discoloration, and it diminishes the signs of premature aging. This one uses an ultra powerful form of vitamin C called THD Asorbate. Again, one little pump. This is not an oil, it is more of a cream, so it spreads evenly and is non-greasy, again, ideal for underneath makeup, but to be used both morning and night. But this is a powerful tool in getting those dark spots to fade quickly, also helps with wrinkling and protecting the skin from photo damage. Cruelty-free, soy-free, paraben-free, sulfate-free, all the frees that you want. It's got it. And this one is the most expensive Sunday Riley's is at $122. So those are my top rated vitamin C's. The way it works, number one, just get it into your regimen. You'll cleanse first. You will then either use a toner, which can have vitamin C or niacinamide in it. Then apply your vitamin C serum, allow it to fully absorb. As you've noticed, quite a few of these have moisturizing components in them. So you may not need an added moisturizer. If you do, since we're getting into the winter months, you can apply your moisturizer and then you will move on with sunscreen, makeup, and all of that. Vitamin C is highly effective if used twice, if your skin can tolerate it, and depending on what percentage that you're using. So morning and night, ideally, if you wanna have maximum impact in getting rid of the discoloration and getting that firmness and even skin tone back. So that's really up to you. If you combine it with retinols, retinoid, those things can be irritants as well. So you really have to listen to your skin. It's gonna tell you everything you need to know. Sometimes alternate days is a great way to start out before you can build it up as part of your regular routine. But it's that combination that truly can change the look of your skin, how it ages, how even it is, how firm it is, all of that. I've seen huge differences. You've heard me talk about this whenever I do my retinoid video and I talk about the tretinoin or the retin-A that I've been using for 12 plus years at this point. All of these things come into play and can really turn back the hands of time, can save you some big time money because you might not need laser treatments or something invasive. So I always try to start with skincare, see what it can do. And if that doesn't work, then, then move to more advanced methods, so, so to speak. But these are my top vitamin C serums. I hope they've been helpful for you. Maybe an introduction to some new products that you haven't seen of or heard of before. Lay out yours below in the comments section. Maybe there's something I haven't listed in this product list that you love, you use. Maybe it's at a great 
price point, whatever, lay it out below, as well as suggestions for future videos. We're in November, December coming up, maybe it's holiday related, um, anything in particular. I always want to know where your headspace is. Social media is where you find me between these Thursday videos at 1 p.m. Central Standard Time. As always, I express my gratitude for your presence. Be bold and be blessed this week, and I look forward to seeing you next week at 1 p.m. Bye-bye.